Hello everyone, in this tutorial I am going to show you how to create a smart block. So I'm going to create smart wall type tags and I'm going to use my rectangle and say quarter by quarter that's the size that I want and then I'm gonna rotate it forty five and I am going to use line quarter that's the size of my line so that would be the block that I'm going to use. First, I have to create an attribute, att enter, and the tag is wall type. What is the wall type? And then a let's put x x for right now. Okay, the justification is middle center, and then the attributes test is uh, a a text style that I used. Uh, and created in my previous videos you can watch that and you can watch how I created the text style for the attributes I am gonna keep the uh, text height 316 and delete this and OK let's unlock position and OK click shift on your keyboard Right click on your mouse and midpoint, mid between two points, one, two, and here's the middle point. Now let's block this. And then I'm going to call it wall type. I'm going to pick a point which is the middle point and I am going to select my objects which is everything and I'm going to make this uh, block annotative and I have to check on open in block editor and then OK click OK and it takes me to the screen and that's where the magic happens when it comes to creating a, a smart block or smart tag I have to go to Let's take this off. Parameters. And in wall type, sometimes we have four ways of the wall could be on the right, could be here, could be here, could be here, or could be here. So I don't want every time, I don't want to have to click on this line and rotate it and move it and rotate it and all that. All I have to do is create this smart. Uh, block where it rotates with everything uh, but not the text and in order for me to do that I have to click on perimeters rotation I want to see the midpoint and this comes this circle comes up and I choose the endpoint Okay, 
and this explanation point has to come up because when I want to the action that I'm gonna take is all about this uh, line because I don't want this line to uh, I don't want to click on this line and then have to edit the block and move it to here I want it to move with the block so I click on the actions rotate click on the line I'm sorry click on the explanation point and then select objects like it says and then OK or hit enter and then close block editor save changes to wall type and now if I want to move it it moves with a block right and then my text I can say A because we have type A type B I don't know what your schedule uh, wall schedule could look like but for right now let's click A and then A will stay a readable A and then it will the black will rotate accordingly.